I have to say we were overwhelmed with the very warm reception that we receive. It has been three years since most of us have been able to travel, not just from Hong Kong to the Middle East, but also the Middle East to Hong Kong. And the fact that we've been able to meet with the top government officials, but also all the major corporations, including all the major sovereign wealth funds and their associated vehicles, means that they too are showing keen interest in working with Hong Kong to invest in Asia. With Saudi Arabia and UAE looking for diversification, they will be looking beyond oil and gas. For us, uh, the focus would be financial services, professional services. On the financial side, they would need a international centre like Hong Kong, who will be able to help them diversify into more renminbi denominated financial products. Also, of course, they are looking at fintech. It's something that Hong Kong is already very strong in. Another area would be ESG and green finance, uh, because all the developments now in the two countries are actually looking at sustainable development. Also, because of the increasing flow of investment and trade between Middle East and Asia, especially mainland China, the legal side, uh, the dispute resolution side, would also be rising. For professional services, it would be a wide range, from people who are involved in infrastructure, especially smart city or green infrastructure, on the innovation and technology side, especially on biotech and health tech, which of course is of high demand, uh, and they are looking for quality solutions, which of course Hong Kong can offer. Now I feel that the areas for collaboration are wide and diverse, and therefore I'm very confident that uh, we will have a very fruitful uh, outcome from our delegation's visit. Hong Kong definitely is the gateway uh, for the rest of the world to Asia region. We need the same partner who can provide us with that sort of support when we go to Middle East and to Africa. And for that, I think definitely UAE is well placed to do it and Saudi is also positioning themselves as providing a very strong market of itself, but also for the region. It makes a lot of sense for us to be able to leverage each other's strengths. The fact that we are now open, we want to tell people that yes, Hong Kong is ready uh, and I want you to come and visit and to also look at all the new developments. Because when you come to a city, of course it's about the business opportunities, but it's also about the vibrancy, the dynamism of a place where they are welcome, where it is culturally diverse, and it's also where they can meet people from around the world. I'm sure you will be seeing us around the world uh, many more times in the coming few months.